Now that we spent a whole lot of time creating this demo web page, let's say that I need to really edit it completely. Let's start with the start page. Well, I've decided I just don't want the start page. So now I'm going to go under this More Actions button, and you're going to see I have all kinds of interesting things here. I can subscribe to the page, I can move the page. That would be if I wanted to move it up or down or somewhere within the, the location. So if I want to put it under the home page, that would be the move, and I can move that around. But I don't want that page at all, so I'm going to go ahead and click Delete the Page. Now it's going to give me the warning. Are you sure you really want to delete this page? Yes, I really do want to delete the page. And it's gone. Now, up to our list page. I need to get rid of this list. Well, unfortunately, there is really no way to get rid of the list with the exception of changing the page template. So, I don't want to delete the page, but I don't want that list set of list in there anymore. So I can come down here and I can click on Change Page Template. And now it's going to say, the list page, would you like to currently make it? Instead of a list page, what would you like to make it? We'll go ahead and make it a web page. And I'll click Change. And now my list page is now a web page and my list is gone. All right. We can manage the site layout. This is where I would be able to see my name of my page, site notices, anything I would want to change on that. Um, if I want to turn on my analytics, that's who visited my website, etc. Um, recent site activity, I can look at my pages. I can look at my attachments if I put any attachments in, any page templates that I might have, any deleted items that I've done, etc. So that allows me to manage my site. I'm going to bounce back. And now I'd like to edit my site layout so you can see what this is. Okay, right now you see that I have a header. I have a sidebar navigation. If I didn't want it as a sidebar, I could put it as a navigation horizontal navigation bar. And I could get rid of the sidebar one. I can do custom footers, I can change my site width, I can customize it, and I can change my colors. So you'll see all the things that you are capable of changing in the edit the site layout section. Finally, last but not least, let's take a look at sharing permissions. This is where you'll find your link to your website. You'll see that anybody currently who, Washington County Public Schools, anyone, can find and edit my site, and I'm currently the owner. If I don't want that, of course, I can change that, and I can say... They can view it only and hit save. And I can come down here and I can invite people to edit my site or I can actually even change the ownership of my site.